Hi, I'm Liam from Fowles and welcome to the Home Renovators Auction Preview for Wednesday the 15th of May 2019 at 10 a.m. Well, I thought I'd show you these first. These are uh, some Featherstone style chairs. Uh, four or five different colours. They're X higher. They're in really good nick. I'm just getting you a yellow one down as well so you can see it. Yellow, orange, green and blue. Uh, and it looks like there's about between sort of four and six of each one unreserved folks uh, so I'll start them all the way at a dollar uh, as I said they're in pretty good nick um, and yeah look I expect um, you know perhaps uh, the popular colors might be 30 40 50 dollars um, but uh, who knows it's, uh, it's an auction so um, I know that when they're hired out they're hired out for a hundred dollars a day if that gives you any idea of, uh, of what they're actually worth beautiful uh, teak day bed here um, it's in I think from about at about that 600 mark I really want to get it going tomorrow so why don't we start the bidding I reckon around uh, three three fifty We'll get the bidding going on that tomorrow. That'll definitely sell. Uh, plenty of bits and pieces to take you through now. We've got heaps of appliances, some beautiful barbecues here, both freestanding barbecues and built-in barbecues as well. Uh, there's one over on this side, I think from memory, about 650. Great big barbie there. And then there's one on one with a hood over the other side. Probably about the same money in there, Euro branded, um, brand new with a warranty, beautiful looking gizmo, that one, have a look at that, absolutely sensational, so really nice built-ins, that'd be a couple of thousand in the shops, but yeah, I reckon about that $550, $600 mark. Through here we've got plenty of freestanding vanities, uh, and you're about sort of uh, around that low 100 mark through to maybe 200 and something, just depending on the size and the bidding. While we're here over the back, there's plenty of these beautiful bowls. Uh, these are stone stone vanity basin bowls. Uh, what did we do these, Megan, last week? About the 50 mark, we're getting them going? $50, folks, for those stone basins. Uh, they're worth 500 bucks, so really fantastic. Uh, some big tall mirrors here. You're looking about that uh, mid 200 mark on those. Uh, over the other way, we've got beautiful teak vanities. Uh, very nice, high fashion teak vanities there. Uh, and looking between probably sort of two and six hundred bucks again, just depending on the, the bidding on the day. Uh, nice looking Kohler bath here. It's a cast iron bath, it's absolutely beautiful. Uh, in the shops, you're looking probably about that $5,000 mark. I reckon more like sixteen, seventeen hundred dollars $1,700 there. Loads of unreserved lighting in this week. Uh, all different bits and pieces, uh, all starting away at a dollar, and they'll be supersonic bargains there. So, uh, really nice buying on all that stuff. You can see uh, there's some LED stuff there, uh, pendants, wall lights. Uh, so, there's a couple of tables of those. Um, they'll be absolutely fantastic. What else can I show you? Have a look at all these stone resin baths. One, two, three, four, five, six of these. They're around that $3,000 mark in the shops. Uh, you'll be about $1,200 tomorrow, folks, and there's a couple of different sizes. Uh, and styles there. Across this back wall I've got heaps of taps, uh, kitchen taps, bathroom taps, some really big designer names uh, in those as well. There's Broadware there I can see. Uh, have a look at this Broadware shower head. Uh, this is an overhead shower with handrail. Retail $2,500. Probably get that going about the $500 mark. Really nice looking gear there. Uh, there's also Cola taps. Um, bathroom taps, uh, bath taps, all sorts of bits and pieces there. Uh, heaps of sinks in tomorrow. Um, down the bottom here, this is interesting, this has just come in, a heap of blinds. Uh, they're Freedom branded blinds uh, and there's a heap of different sizes. Uh, won't be a lot of money attached to those, so if you need to redo the blinds in your house, as you know, it costs thousands of dollars out in the field. Um, probably could do a couple of hundred dollars and get your whole house done. Cooktops, mountains of cooktops in tomorrow, uh, and a heap of sinks as well. I've probably got about 400 sinks in, maybe 500 different sinks, mostly Frankie branded. Uh, range hoods, uh, Electrolux range hoods, uh, Euro range hoods, all kinds of different ones there, absolutely beautiful. What else can I show you? There's a microwave down here, there's a couple of coffee machines, three different Jura coffee machines, they're made in Switzerland. Usually between sort of fifteen hundred and two thousand, they'll be well under a thousand. They'll be more like five hundred bucks tomorrow. They're absolute rippers. Um, some nice basins down the bottom there. More sinks, uh, more cooktops. We've got some showers coming through. Uh, plenty of range hoods. The, the range there'll be, I reckon, there'll be about sixty odd range hoods there. There's a nice big pallet of those there. Lots of refrigerators, loads of dishwashers in. Uh, and with the dishwashers, you're probably between one hundred and fifty and about. Oh, $350, $400. Across the way I can see some beautiful uh, freestanding cookers, wine fridges. There's some really nice wine fridges. Uh, nice big, uh, the, the black high sense, uh, the French door uh, black glass high sense fridge there. That's really nice. 
What else can I show you? Another table of lighting down here. So we've got plenty of lighting on, on all of that as well. We'd be unreserved, so uh, really nice. And then there's a third table of lighting. So I reckon there'd be at least uh, 100 designer lights in tomorrow. So a really good offering on the lighting. Uh, there's a little bit of teak furniture left, so we'll clear all this out tomorrow. That None of this will be left here tomorrow, I wouldn't think. Uh, some sling chairs, some beautiful dining chairs, some bar stools there, uh, folding chairs there, so they'll, they'll all get going, we'll clear all of that out tomorrow. Uh, some office chairs there, they'll be unreserved. Uh, some beautiful bedding through here as well, we've got uh, a heap of different uh, beds available there. Uh, that one's an interesting one, that one's a queen size, but it's also got uh, the gas lift storage underneath, I think they were around... Oh, 300 bucks or three or three or four hundred bucks for that so um, you know you'd be mountains of money in the shops of course uh, so plenty of bits and pieces through here nice uh, matching tall boy and also uh, the drawers there for that bed freestanding cookers mountains of freestanding cookers in uh, and a heap of complete kitchens uh, probably about six or seven complete kitchens in this one we've had for a few weeks now this bath would sell in the shops for sixteen thousand dollars um, I reckon we'll get that going for maybe a couple of thousand dollars. Uh, it's a Cola Soak SOK Whirlpool, so you can Google that and see what all of that's about. Uh, some air conditioners there as well. We might quickly go out and have a look outside. Oh, this is an interesting one. Uh, this one is an Ilvi 1200ml uh, dual oven cooker. Uh, it's a factory return, so it's uh, been returned to its supplier. Um, it'll come complete with brand new burners, 16 grand in the shop, so I reckon it'll be about, I'll get the bidding going for about 1,500, um, so uh, a tenth of its money. More ex-hire furniture here, that'll all be unreserved. There's some black couches and there's some grey ones of those as well, so there's plenty of those available. Um, outside I can see we've got some uh, outdoor furniture, both dining and lounge outdoor dining furniture. Uh, plenty of baths and I've got a heap of statues here as well. Um, th these will all be to clear, get rid of all those. And then across the way, uh, we've got a heap of teak uh, statue animals as well. And probably most of those will get them going about that sort of $50 mark, I imagine. They're worth hundreds and hundreds. Uh, the horse over the back, it's not bad looking horse. It'll be, I reckon, at least $2,000 in the shops. Um, and I will get the bidding going at $500 tomorrow. So uh, that will definitely sell. Someone will take that home at $500 hundred dollars an absolute ripping by someone there it might bid up of course but I reckon about 500 is probably right there okay let's have a quick look through we've got I can see some spa baths over there some splashbacks over the way way back uh, into the carpet and floor coverings auction where carpet often sells for less than seven dollars a square meter it looks like there's about 250 lots in there today and then over in Michael's timber and building materials auction he's got a good seven or eight hundred lots so all in all three fantastic looking auctions we can't wait to see you here tomorrow at 10 a.m thanks for watching